Grant County, Oregon is a land of natural beauty. A good portion of the terrain in this 4,500 square mile area in Eastern Oregon is made up of native forest, mountains, lakes, and streams. The views are spectacular and outdoor recreation is just minutes away, if not right on your doorstep. People come here because they want to get off the beaten path and experience the changing seasons close to nature. The peaceful setting, however, is anything but sleepy. Grant County is attracting more and more digital commuters, entrepreneurs, retirees, and families who are welcomed into communities that are vibrant and innovative. Exciting things are happening to attract businesses, visitors, and new residents to the city of John Day. This picturesque town was established at the turn of the 20th century on either side of the John Day River and is spread along a scenic valley in the majestic Strawberry Mountains of Grant County. Main Street in John Day is a busy place, and guess what? It's growing! Business development is strong in this community and more people are discovering that they can sustain the lifestyle they want at a lower cost of living compared to metro areas. At the local brewery, you're just as likely to get a baked from scratch treat as you are a unique brew. There are also coffee shops and a variety of restaurants in John Day where you can grab a quick bite and beverage or sit down to a relaxing meal. Your meal just might contain some local produce if lettuce or cucumbers are on your salad or sandwich. The city has been instrumental in the development of this new state-of-the-art greenhouse that uses hydroponic growing systems and reclaimed water to produce vegetables for the local and surrounding communities. The controlled environment inside the structure is automated to deliver precise inputs for growing efficiency. Goals for this city-led project are not only to provide healthy, fresh food, but to birth a new local industry. The greenhouse is part of an aggressive project to develop 83 acres of land along the river. Called the John Day Innovation Gateway, this stretch of land includes 20 initiatives, one of which is a project plan to renovate the structure you see here into an open-air pavilion. Recreation areas along the riverfront are included in the Community Development Plan in the city of John Day. There's a variety of outdoor activities available for kids and youth, from softball, baseball, and soccer, to playgrounds for climbing, sliding, and swinging. The new mountain bike trails, constructed on the hillside overlooking the city, has brought a new pastime to the area. Mountain biking is a strenuous sport, but adults and kids love it because it develops skill, muscles, and stamina. And it's just plain fun. One reason why outdoor activities are so popular in Grant County is because of our climate. We have four distinct seasons that change the view of the valley as the months roll by and our average temperatures are quite moderate. There is no doubt that families love it here. Our population is growing and so is our median household income. With an average commute time of five to nine minutes, families find more time to be active because they have less time on the road. Both visitors and residents rave about the immaculate nine-hole course at the John Day Golf Club. Golfers like the challenge of changing elevations within the course as well as its affordability. It's a popular meeting place for friends as well as families who want to pass on their love for the sport to their kids. Oregon Trail pioneers aren't the only people who settled here. Head over to the Cam Wa Chung State Heritage Site to learn how Chinese settlers contributed to the culture of our county. Be sure you visit both the museum and the interpretive site, including the collection of medicinal herbs. With a 25-bed hospital in John Day and a 40-bed care center in Prairie City, the Blue Mountain Hospital provides Grant County residents with health care that is close to home. 
The hospital has heavily invested in technology and has a team of exceptional professionals that deliver care with compassion and skill. The hospital includes a surgery clinic as well as a family practice clinic. Specialty clinics are offered on an ongoing basis. The emergency department has 24-hour coverage and is level 4 trauma certified. The vastness of our landscape makes travel by small plane the perfect option for individuals and business people. The Grant County Regional Airport is just south of John Day. The industrial park adjacent to the airport includes sites of varying sizes. 24 one-acre lots are already developed and shovel-ready. There are many incentives available for relocating or starting a business here, including long-term rural enterprise zone and tailored financing options. The industrial park is just one area that is being actively developed in John Day. Plans are underway to transform other parts of the city, such as this hillside and valley. The city is evaluating plans to develop over 100 acres of residential land for new housing developments and is offering 7% cash back and payment of all system development charges on all new home construction within the city limits. From John Day, travel east to Prairie City. Here you'll find an example of how the towns in this county have combined historic charm with livability. On the main thoroughfare, you can comb the stores for vintage treasures and western wear, shop for essentials, then meet with friends for a leisurely meal. There's a strong business community here, open to new ideas as well as new residents. Prairie City has its own public school that serves students K through 12 with small class sizes and support from a close-knit community. Canyon City is county seat of Grant County. This town popped up after gold was discovered here in 1862. The town might not be as bustling as it was during the Oregon Gold Rush, but the quiet streets and friendly businesses here sustain a simple and active life. There are many reasons why people have made Grant County, Oregon their home. The beauty of our natural setting, the proximity of outdoor recreation, a low stress lifestyle along with all the amenities and community resources you want. Maybe it's time for you to check out Grant County for yourself. You just might find the opportunity and the life you've been looking for.